Hello everyone, welcome to App Fetch. If you don't like scrolling through loads of screens to find your application, this will do it easier and faster. It will do it in three main ways really. We have different categorizations to make it faster and easier to find your application. Uh, we have automation and we have narrowing down. If we, first of all, we look at the idea of different categorizations. Now, obviously on the right hand side here we have uh, ABCs for first letter of the uh, application and then in the middle we have Google Play categories and on the right hand side uh, sorry on the left hand side we have colors so if you want to find any application you can find it with either one of these categories so press L for line clear it up press communication and line is up again and press green and you can see line now the good thing about this also is we can narrow it down because there are a few icons up there so you can then just press two categories at the same time so at green and communication it narrows down to three and then you press L and you narrow down to only one a line so all of these things are automated color of the icon when you first in install the application it will go through and automatically uh, categorize all your applications by color by Google Play categories and by first letter. Now, then you have a few other options. For example, you can do install, uninstall, sorry. Uh, you press the L again, line, tap and hold, and you can uninstall here. Now, there are a few other options you can do. Now, in order to make it easier and faster, if we just go to an application, okay, K box and then you have a, f a floating window here and you can automatically just press the floating window to bring up your application and you can do that from anywhere even inside a running application uh, now some other things that we can do we can have we have an edit categories and we have a edit colors first of all look at edit categories here you can see if you don't like the Google Play categories and you want to organize it yourself you can drag uh, any icon from the, the right hand side into a different category so if for some unknown reason you think Chrome should be in social you can drag it across and put it in there again also if you don't like these categories you want to use your own you want to make less or make more you can do so by tapping plus and adding a category okay and you can also use the uninstall feature from here one other thing so we also looked at edit colors here you can do that the color icons are pretty much 98 percent right the categorization but if you see one or two which are perhaps you prefer in a different color you can drag a uh, drag across from here to the left hand side so the final thing, we, I mentioned the floating window, here is under launch preferences. So here you can decide if the, the, the little floating window icon that appears, you can decide to have it in just the app drawer and home, or you can, uh, you can just have it from the home and app drawer only, or you can also launch it as a standard app, which means it won't appear, and you can just launch uh, app, app fetch as a basic app. Okay, so that's the some of the main features of App Fetch. Thank you.